Welcome back to another video here on the Co-op Position Challenge. Today I'm going to be drinking Kirkland's 24-year-old Speedside Single Malt Scotch Whiskey Sherry Cast Finish. Let's crack it open and see what it tastes like. All right, what's going for her nose? Oh yeah. First thing that really stands out is that sherry, but you also get like that single malt traditional smell from like a speed side with a nice maltiness, a little bit of a slight hint of funk, like that right amount, not very overpowering. But there's nice sweetness, but that uh, sherry is really standing out, but definitely Look at that color. That is a, a very nice dark color. I wonder if these are fresh dump barrels or actually added in coloring. I highly doubt it because this is actually a bottling by Alexander Murray and they typically do not do any coloring at all and that color is very dark and very rich. But yes, it has a very nice nose. It's really up there in the proof. I believe it's actually, I believe it's 92. Yeah, 92 proof. So yeah, it is up there. But, um, yeah, a nice floral, nice hint of, like, caramel, like a butterscotch caramel candy. Maybe with a slight uh, hint of, like, orange and then, like, a hint of citrus as well. But, like, that rind, kind of, like, the just the skin when you uh, zest, like, a orange or a lime. All right, what's going for a taste? Oh yeah, definitely a sherry bomb. Get all that sherry, nice sweetness. Kind of pulls in the cheeks as well. Mmm, really coats the palate nicely. And you feel that sherry all the way in the back of your palate. And it's lasting pretty long. Alright, let's go for another. Oh yeah, very nice sherry bomb. I really like this, how it's very sherry forward, especially for something being this age. Having that oak, having a little bit of tannins, and having that nice, like, like that, um, I don't know what you call it, but when your cheeks kind of squeeze in, and from all like that, uh, that sherry and everything, it just, a very nice mouthfeel. Kind of get that um, that zest, kind of like the more of the rind of it is what's really coming off on the palate. And it turns into like a, a candy, like apple, then like to like a, a cinnamon with that wood and everything that's going on there with that age. And it has like a slight hint of rye kind of like on the back end almost like from a bourbon kind of that little spice it kind of like has that rye bite as well but definitely the uh the main note for this is definitely that sherry it stands right up in the front very formative it's right there and that's literally all much pretty much what you get oh yeah that's a very nice nose i'm liking what's going on Yeah, it's a very nice, simple spee side with that uh, very, very sherry forward palette. But yes, thanks again for watching, guys. Do not forget to like, comment, and subscribe. I'll see you guys next week. May the best of your past, may the worst of your future. Cheers, guys.